Summons qualifying night A main event off of corner number four is underway. Excellent start from McIntosh on the bottom. Denny seats some ground out of turn number two. Cannon trying to get away and wrap it. As he's in the early lead, Denny battling with Hoover for position two. Man, Hoover quickly into second. What a night he's having. Three wide with Denny and Pickens. Hoover to the top, Denny to the bottom. Give the spot to Denny at the line. These guys can't afford to race each other that hard for that long if they want a shot at Cannon McIntosh. As Pickens gonna muscle his way into the bottom. No can do, can't get underneath Denny. Hoover slingshotting around the outside and into second. Emilio Hoover's having the night of his life. Can he hold through this with 27 laps as he picks up the front end again? Contact with Jacob Denny. Here comes Carrick around the outside. Pickens on the bottom. We expected a motivated and strong run for Tanner Carrick. And with the fact we've got two distinct grooves already, Clint Boyles, that bounds well, that bodes well for Carrick, who's now moved past Pickens. But third spot is up and four potential moving here. Pickens opening the door down low to Briscoe. Briscoe looking to step through as they're three wide. Briscoe so good on the bottom that last time by and three and four able to get the drive off. And here he is challenging Pickens. Slider for the lead though. There goes Tanner Carrick to the top spot with 16 to go. Pickens in the back of McIntosh. That slows all of them up. Tanner Carrick trying to run away. More contact. That's goal begin to Pickens. He's all jacked up down the back stretch. Cannon is rallying. He's starting to put some good laps back together. We've seen this as one of his abilities is to have a bad lap or two, but really rally late. He's got to keep Briscoe off him on the bottom. And now the door open around the top for Golovic. Yeah, went to the bottom to protect against Briscoe. But here comes Golovic, the slider line through the middle. He'll take a two for one. Golovic to second. McIntosh fires back to the inside of three and four. Driving hard to the inside at turn number three. Back Battling hard for the second spot. McIntosh trying to get down and close it on Golubic. Golubic precise down low in one and two. Give him second for now. Oh, he hit that line perfectly in one and two to the top in three and four is going to open the lane for McIntosh, but Golubic's got the momentum. Here comes Briscoe saying, my turn to challenge as here comes your battle for the lead. Golubic in striking distance. He smells blood in the water. Goes bottom side in three and four. Shows a nose under Carrick as another lap puts off seven to go. Carrick's going to know he's there. Golubic gets into the middle. Cheats up to the cushion of the exit of turn number two. See how he attacks him in turn number three. Gonna follow him in kind of through the middle. Exits high, keeps the momentum up. Six to go. What kind of move is Golubic planning here late? Lap traffic might be Tanner Carrick's saving grace. If he can get there and block that inside line for Golubic, that's gonna protect any sort of slide job or big move. But he's only got five laps to get there as he sees it right in front of him. And here comes oh. Cannon getting into the picture. Oh, Almost contact. Two cars stopped, and that's what had everybody check up. Who's the first to put their name in 2024's book as we're back underway? Carrick gets to the top quickly. That gives Golubic a run at him in one and two. So we take a look at that battle in oh. behind and look out. You've got but, company Shane Golubic in the form of Chase Briscoe. The yellow lights are on in the arena. That was McIntosh. Huge, yeah, huge contact between McIntosh and Chris Windham. Let's take a peek at it from the speed cam. Oh. Right across the nose, and Reimer loops it around, keeps going. Nice save. Pickens and Wyndham back under the green flag. I don't think that was a great start for Tanner Carrick, guys. Getting into the corner. Shane Golubic digging hard on the bottom. Got close. He's closer. Is this the big slide job coming? A little short coming off the corner. Carrick and Golubic one and two. Up in third, Pickens dicing it out with Briscoe, but your top two trying to break away and settle this between themselves. Coming to two laps to go. Golubic showing a nose once again underneath as he drag races down the front straightaway to the bottom goes Golubic. Here's an opening. Shane Golubic, contact with the right rear. It's a drag race and a turn three for the lead. Carrick getting down to try to make the block. Golubic, big mistake, getting down off the berm. One to go for Carrick, who gets loaded, trying to defend the slide again, but Golubic rallying on the last lap into the final set of corners. Carrick down low. Golubic, one more prayer. Off the turn, give it to Tanner Carrick, your winner on Monday night of the Chili Bowl. Wow. Shane Golubic will punch his ticket to Saturday night's A main event with a second place finish, but Tanner Carrick, a two-time Monday prelim winner at the Chili Bowl.